Welcome to Bandura Retirement Village, and we're going to discover today what could be the next phase of your life living in a welcoming, friendly community in a lifestyle retirement village. I have Margarita and Ian with me today. Tell us a bit about living in a retirement village and that sort of lifestyle. For those who are thinking about it, what made you consider that sort of lifestyle? I guess it's the flexibility of having a community around you, but also having the ability to pack up and go when you want to and feel secure that your place is being looked after, someone, the neighbours are keeping an eye out on it, and all the rest of those sort of um, things that make you feel safe. Our granddaughters are just five or six minutes down the road and we can do the school pickups and bring them here and they enjoy the swimming pool. Oh, and wonderful. we've had a lot of fun here with them. Because lifestyle is a big part of, of the village here in Bandura, so the grandkids enjoy that as well, the swimming pool and That's all right. the facilities. There's always lots of things happening, and you can be part of that happening as well on the, the actual social committee, those sort of activities. It's fun planning them as well as actually doing them. Also, the community, so having like-minded people around, and that sort of environment is welcoming as well and enjoyable. Yes, we, you know, within a few days of coming here, we had met a couple of our neighbours, and um, one of them was watering the other's garden because they'd been away for a while. It's welcoming, and uh, but not too familiar. Right, so that independent life, we often say that you can choose to do as much as you like or as little as you like, so that independent living and that flexibility is something that appeals. Ian's already been approached about putting out chairs for bingo and things like that and serving behind the bar and there's a gardening um, interest group here that we're both interested in. The lovely thing about living in a smaller home is you're not tied down to lots of maintenance and things like that so you can get up, do some exercise, go for a walk pop around in the garden, chat to the neighbours, those sort of things, and, and drive off, explore the area. With. And I have to say one of the really convenient things is having those shops within walking distance, because you can see that as you're going to get older and you don't want to perhaps drive as much, you can just walk up to Coles up there and, um, mm. and Uni Hill, I think it is, and, yeah. and, um, and do your shopping, there's hairdressers, there's all of the amenities there, and our doctor is now within five minutes walk, which is great. And finding, finding a new doctor was a bit of a challenge because you've sort of gotten used to all of the things that, um, and all of the people and services that you're with and having to move to a new area can be a little bit of a challenge. But people here are really helpful and make recommendations. And we have a nurse on site and she's wonderful. She just checks on you every now and again. And, and uh, you know, really early in the piece, we were told if you're feeling lonely, you can ring up the nurse and have a chat. Everybody is obviously taking care in their gardens. We enjoy gardening and, and being in a landscaped garden like this, living in that is really nice. And you go for walks and you feel really comfortable in that as well. Mm. So um, People have already offered us cuttings and that kind of thing. So that's really friendly and, and welcoming. And the family and the grandkids love it in the pool and they... Yeah. What's it like when they come and have a swim? It must That's <laughs> wonderful. Yeah, it's really quite interesting. It's nerve-wracking for us because we're trying to say, don't run, don't run, and they're so excited that they're racing around the place. But, um, but they've enjoyed it. We've had a couple of sleepovers, we'll sleep over now, and a couple of meals with them. What we found, we did some overseas holidays, a cruise and that, but what we enjoyed most was actually just meeting people. And this is like living in a cruise ship in that way, but it's so convenient. And that's, I think, what gives you that buzz each day is to get out and see how people are going and, and that as well. We give each other a lift, I think, in that way, the community. Mm -hmm. So that's really good. And it's quite inspiring to see some of the older people and just how much they still do in the community. Mm -hmm. You know, when we first started looking at it, we probably walked through at least half a dozen times. We showed friends through. And each time we bumped into someone, they said, oh, you're going to love it here. Mm. And we do. And uh, now over to you. We'd love to meet you and show you around. So uh, make contact and come and see it for yourself here at Bandura Village and Centennial Living. Mm.